Hello everyone. Today I'll talk about three types of data science roles that is currently popular in the market and what are the skills you need if you want to become one of the data scientists in those categories. Not all the data science jobs are the same. In fact, data science can be broken down into three key roles. Business intelligence data science role, product analytics data science role, and the last one is machine learning data science role. If you look for all the job descriptions that are currently out in the market today, you will be able to realize that it falls under one of these categories. So if you are considering a career in data, it is extremely important to understand which path will fit your skills and interest. Let's try to break it down. The first one was BI focused data science role. BI data scientists usually focus on data collection, data processing, building the KPIs, building the reporting and dashboards. So they actually ensure the business have clean structured data pipeline. They also make sure that the reports and dashboards and KPIs are meeting the business requirements for the leadership to track what metrics they want to track, right? So think about all the dashboard building, SQL queries and automation, automation of the reports for leadership teams. So what could be the key skills needed for this role? As you can imagine, SQL is needed because you have to collect a lot of data from different data databases. Then, as I mentioned, when we talk about dashboarding, data visualization skills and storytelling skills is needed. So you have to either learn one of the tools like Power BI, Tableau, Looker, and there are many, right? So the exact tool doesn't really matter much. However, your skills to build the dashboard, how do you interpret, how do you build the schema relational model behind all the data that you have collected. Those kind of skills matter a lot. Then of course, you're gonna do a little bit of data engineering, so ETL pipelines. Uh, when I say ETL, it's about extracting, transforming and loading the data, right? So you can collect the data from one data source and do some processing aggregation and you move into another data source uh, for analytics, right? So you need a little bit of data engineering skill. So mainly business leaders, operations team, finance teams, those are the teams that will usually look for and hire for the BI focused data science roles. Now the second category is product analytics or product focused data science role. What they do, they actually help product managers to make better decisions using the data. This role involves heavy use of A-B testing, experimental design, hypothesis testing, user behavior analysis to improve the products. So they help product managers answer the questions like, did this feature actually improve the user engagement? If I change this feature with a new design, will I get more traction from the user? So those kind of things. If I do X, Y will happen. But how do I validate that the Y happened? And if Y happened, then what is the metrics that I want to track? Is that improving, right? So if I change a feature and my goal is to improve the click-through rate, for example, then I need to be able to make sure that using the previous version versus the new version, what is the difference? How much change it happened? Is a change enough to justify for me to make the investment? All this kind of business decisions are made by data scientists to help product managers to launch those features, improve those features. Without doing proper analysis and experimentation, none of the features will be approved or implemented by the engineering team. Data scientists actually work every day very closely with product managers in this case. So the last category of data scientists is about machine learning data scientists and what they do. They actually go beyond analytics and build predictive models to solve the business models. They are the one who actually build ML models and put that model in production and then solve the business problem. They could be working on recommendation engine, fraud detection, some sort of personalization model, natural language processing, any type of model. So it could be different algorithms for different use cases, but what they actually do is implement that machine learning to to help the business problem, right? So their role actually involves ML modeling, feature engineering, model deployment, etc. So what do you think the key skills needed for this role? Of course, machine learning and deep learning, right? So because now they have to understand a little bit deeper of how these algorithms are used, how can they tune the parameters, how can they pick the right model for the right problem? So those are very important things. Then feature engineering and data pre-processing, right? Before you even build the model, you have to make sure that you have that 
skills needed for exploratory data analysis. How do you analyze all these variables you have? What variables will play an important role in the modeling? Can you do a lot of this variable interaction or feature interaction? How do you understand what features will matter uh, to the model versus not? How do you engage with domain experts to understand those features? That kind of thing will matter. And then lastly, the, the very key skills that is tested is MLOps and model deployment, right? So your MLOps skill is about how do you monitor the model after you put the model in production? How do you make sure data drift and context drift that kind of drifting is handled how do you make sure the retraining cycles is properly managed how do you make sure the feedback loop is properly managed you know like you build a model start making prediction from tomorrow but if the customer or whoever is using your model is not giving you feedback how can you improve your model you cannot right so you have to make sure you put a proper feedback loop in place so it's all about taking the models from your notebook to the production so those kind of skills you need uh, and then you mostly collaborate with data engineers, ML engineers, business stakeholders, of course, to gather the problem requirements. And that is it. I hope you will understand all these three roles now. What is each data science role means, even though the title is just saying the data scientist. And I hope you, this video will help you to navigate which role you will fit or align closely with. And then you will make a right decision. Thank you. Bye-bye.